Chat says, sexy spook. Welcome everyone. It's bone season, again, appropriately enough. Talk about a sexy word. Today I'm gonna play Grim Fandango, uh, which is maybe a bit of a forgotten game at this point, but uh, I, I think it's pretty cool. This is a, uh, I actually have some fun facts assembled for you guys about this game, if you'll, if you'll hear me. This might be insanely boring to some, but uh, if you find it boring, just uh, eat a dick, I don't know. <laughs> anyway, uh, so this game came out on October 30th, 1998. Uh, while I was alive, I was kind of surprised, I was like, damn, this actually came out of my lifetime. Uh, which is, as you know, right before Halloween and Dia de los Muertos. Uh, it's published by Lucas LucasArts. Uh, its main creative director is Tim Schafer, who you may know as somebody who previously worked on the Monkey Island series, co-creating Day of the Tentacle and designing Full Throttle. Uh, after that, he went on to form his own company, Double Fine, which made the best game ever, Psychonauts, and then made some other games. Uh, and... He also worked with a lot of the people that he worked with in LucasArts there, too. Uh, the word Fandango, I looked this up, it actually is a type of dance. It's a type of flamenco dance that's very, like, expressive and dramatic. Uh, and they use castanets. It's like tap dancing, but harder, because you have to tap with- you have to keep rhythm with both your feet and your fucking castanets. It's pretty cool. I didn't know that flamenco was, like, a broad... Apparently there are, like, 50 different types of flamenco. I didn't know any of this. And also, uh, Andalusia, which is where the flamenco... Or where the Fandango specifically is from, looks like a fucking Bloodborne DLC. <laughs> like, look at this shit. Isn't this fucking awesome? I wanna play this video game. Oh yeah, and this is a... <laughs> this is what the... This is a traditional Fandango. It's very, like, flamboyant and sort of, what's the word, like, phlegmatic, I guess? Wet Dry World. I think that's, uh, that's from Italy. I forget the name of that city. Same place, uh, same place they used in Overwatch for I Ilios. Ilios. Traveling to Ilios. But yeah, uh, this game sort of has a, it's, it's a weird mishmash of styles. It's sort of like a pulp noir, Aztec, fucking point-and-click razzmatazz. It's, it's very bizarre, but I, I've only played halfway through it before. Uh, and this is the rem remastered edition, of course, because the original, just, you can't even get it to work. So I'm excited, I'm gonna play it. I've only played halfway through this game before, so I'm excited to see the rest of it. Uh, even if it is a bit hokey. This game's a little hokey. It's not actually very fun to play, but it's... The the design and the writing and the voice acting and all that is very, very nice. It's just that... that dang actual gameplay getting in the way. Alright, uh, so, I'm, yeah, I'm just gonna do a new game. Bada bing, bada boom. Just checking to make sure it's at a good volume. Oh yeah, and the, <clears throat> the remaster is published under Double Fine, even though it was originally LucasArts. Kind of weird how that works. <gasps> oh yeah, and this game has like the most amazing, like, comfy, Sorry for the wait, Mr. early 3D I modeling ever. Take you now. Take me? It's like Mist era. No, no, there's no need to be nervous. Nervous? Mm, no, it's just your appearance. It's a little intimidating. Intimidating me, but I'm your friend. My name's Manny Calavera. I'm Someone says finally caught a steam. I don't want Thank to God. Travel agent. I want to go home. I'm happy you could make it. <laughs> you can't go home, Celso. You're dead. But you're not alone. Everybody here is just as dead as you. That's why we call it the land of the dead. Are you ready for your big journey? No. <laughs> what journey? The four-year journey of the soul. I don't know if it's, like, explicitly four years, but the whole journey to, like, the afterlife is a huge thing in Dia de los Muertos, from what I understand. But here it's, like, framed as there's, like, the Grim Reaper, but he's a travel agent. Maybe try a luxury ocean cruise? Or 
If you led a very good life, you may even be eligible for a ticket on the number nine itself. The number nine? Number That's nine? top of the line express train. It shoots straight to the ninth underworld, the land of eternal rest, in four minutes instead of four years. Damn. But very few people qualify. You need to be a bougie one percenter records. fuck to get the nine train. That is a fallout ass computer. Well, Look at the reflection on this glass. Is the train appears to be just out of your reach, but I still got a couple of tricks up my sleeve here. Mm -hmm. So basically all the remaster did was just spruce yes, up the graphics a little bit, and they're still a tiny bit crusty. Line. But it's just higher definition now, basically. Yes, she's a beauty. That compass in the handle will sure come in handy. Too. Excelsior! Oh, you're going to have a great trip. Wish I was going. Why don't you? You could give me a lift. Oh, I we can see the crust, actually. There's a switch to turn the crust the back on. Be. Believe it or not. Service, eh? Well, I guess there are some folks worse off than me. <laughs> oh, I'll be leaving here soon enough. No thanks to dead and no commission low-life cases like yours, Menso. I don't know what Menso means. Oh, this lady. The boss told gets me out to the aggressions, you don't it? Tonight. He wants to talk to you about something when he gets back from his trip. I'll crust Tell the bones. Don not to worry. I'm not going anywhere. <laughs> Especially not with clients like that. <laughs> Where do they get these guys? They For a second I thought he was gonna sleep in there. Oh, he's standing on stilts, right? Good. <laughs> I can't work off my time and I'm stuck. Stuck selling walking sticks to a bunch of burros for eternity. Burros. I need better clients. I need a real saint. I need a lead on a rich, dead saint. <laughs> oh, abrupt transition to actual gameplay. ¿Qué es esto? ¿Qué es esto? I don't speak Spanish, by the way. Like, I know a tiny, tiny scraps. Oh, I'm mousing around in OBS right now like a damn fool. What's this target on the ground? Okay, well, here we are. Uh, do you want crust immediately? Do, does, do people just demand crust? Options. Uh, crust mode. Wait, 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 wait. No, 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 no. Where is it? I might have missed it. Uh, special features, maybe? Ah, there we go. Original! There's the crust, alright. It's not even that much different, honestly. It's just higher resolution. I, honestly, that's not as bad as I was expecting it to be. Uh, but here we are. So yeah, you click around. By the way, I'm gonna play this game mostly with my left hand. I actually have two mice set up. I have my, like, handshake mice. Or my handshake mouse in a weird position, and then I have a left hand mouse. I don't think this game requires much precision. So, I'm, I'm trying to take it easy on my right hand, which is kind of why I'm playing a point and click for, uh... Spooktober right now. Dual gaming setup. Wow, that thing flipped around. But look at that, those quaint little animations. To all agents from office manager Don Copel. All right, you boneheads. Thank you, lucky stars, and get to your How often do you think he calls we them boneheads? We poisoning on our hands. Too many dead to assign specific cases. Oh my so god, it's fucking coronavirus. First, come, first serve. So let's see some hustle out there. Whatever you say, Iffy. Iffy. See, I didn't get that one. Is that like Heifer? Cow? Perhaps? It's probably not the same Latin root, huh? Iffy is boss. Alright. Pick that up. I don't know how Better committed I am cards. to the left handed play, like honestly. A long day of solitaire for me. So you know, that was like a Scooby-Doo door. I forget, it was like Roger Ebert had a name for that. I forget. It was like the Tom and Jerry tint or something when you can tell that something's getting, like interactable in a game. The deck of cards just wouldn't help there. Oh, put away the deck of cards. Right. So your inventory is your little, uh, your, your coat. And when you, it like zooms in, it's got a scythe. That's kind of a neat way of showing the inventory, I always thought. Anyway, cancel. Effie baby. Alright, and, and look at like the design of all these rooms is really cool. There's tons of detail. It's hella aesthetic. <laughs> oh, the game does not automatically save. Please save in the pause menu to avoid losing progress. By the way, that's literally just for crashes. Also, I'm going to change off the crust. We're back to remastered. 
Um, oh yeah, and I think we could like stretch it out. Actually, is it stretched? Let me check. I should have checked this beforehand. I think it is. It must be. Right? I'm gonna keep it square. Yeah, I think it was stretched. Okay. Uh, it's kind of hard to tell sometimes. Uh, so yeah, it, they mentioned his last name is Calaveras, by the way, which is a term for... I think it just means skull, but it also... Oh, I think you can make him run by double-clicking, yeah. Uh, it means skull, but it's also like specifically a kind of like decorational skull that they make in, in, in Dia, Dia de los Muertos celebrations. Sure. Let's talk to this chick. Buenos dias. Manny, why aren't you at the poisoning? <laughs> what poisoning? The I already know the poisoning. The poisoning that everybody's at but you. Why do I send out memos if nobody reads them? Yeah, they're made out of sometimes sugar. I guess it's supposed to be like you put them out for the people who are dead and they, they're like, Mmm, tasty me skull made out of sugar. Yum yum. Where was Honestly, it seems like a pretty again? chill holiday. Just ask your driver for crying out loud. He'll know. Any messages for me? Besides the one about the poisoning? Yeah. I only have one other message for you, Manny. I'm not your secretary. Wow. I don't take your messages. So this get it through your skull and stop forwarding bitch. your phone to me. All right. But that sounded more like four messages to me. In my heart, you're still my secretary. I'm just gonna like actively try to piss In her off. In my heart, though, you're still my secretary. Manny, what are you talking about? By the way, about? is it a good boy? I was never your secretary, even when you were on top. I got one boss, same as you, Don Copel. Come on. I'm just gonna I keep going through this. Fuck it. Man besides Don. I don't remember very much about this game. About? So. I know you take memos well, for her. I remember like sometimes. lots of specific uh, moments, Manny, but like the puzzles and the dialogue you? and shit. So I'm just, I'm gonna be chilling. I might not be talkative, not as talkative as I normally am during games like this. Busy as ever, I see. I'd have more work to do if you had more clients. Ouch. Youch. All right, I already know where everybody is. I like how when you exhaust dialogue options, they just point you, they just like funnel you to the fucking like poisoning event. So, you going to the Christmas party? After the spectacle you made of yourself last year? I wow. wouldn't miss it for the world. Huh. Any good gossip? Well, I heard Domino got a raise. Like Domino's like the. Tell me some good news, why don't you? He's like the shitty. Uh, all I really need, Bayessa. Zap Brannigan, co-worker. Well, I gotta go hit the bricks. Okay, you show those bricks a lesson. I'm gonna hit exactly one brick. Look at this. You can even see what the pictures are on her desk. Are those like pills? We... No. Oh, that's just talking to her. I don't think I can grab anything on her desk. Someone said take her lamp. I'm afraid I cannot do that. Oh, wait. Oh, shit, shit, shit. No, wait. I might still be able to take her bricks yet. Nope. They're <laughs> not her bricks. Her fucking... Her lamp. The thing happened. You, you ever get that thing? Where you read a word and you're talking? You know what I'm talking about. Also, I like how these... The, like, fancier animations are in a lower frame rate than the... The ones of, like, actual character models. So look at this shit. This game looks awesome. Even though it is kind of old and crusty. And I gotta say, the gameplay is less than stellar. Ah, the old head of the department. Way before my time, I heard he was a total slave driver. <laughs> yeah, so I guess it's, it's, like I said, it's kind of a mishmash of art deco, Aztec noir styles. Which is a weirdly good aesthetic. I never knew that would work. There she is, the number nine. One of these nice. days, I'm gonna ride her right on out of here. Many memes I could go with, with number nine, you know? Not only the Beatles, it's but locked. also Mr. Game & Watch. Mighty number nine is also on the table. Like, I remember just this first area taking me a while when I was younger. Now also, my guy, computer's kind of chugging at this, at this game. for the lobby renovation. <laughs> he just paid for the lobby renovation. This guy was no he wasn't like a god or anything. He just he just donated. Not that I have a choice, but I wonder if I'd be happier working on a ship. Then again, I'm so competitive, I wouldn't be able to relax until I was captain. Hmm. It's locked. Okay. This is a game where I'm always like, where do I go? 
So, so if anybody here has like played this game like a trillion times and knows all the puzzles, even just this, like moving around, sometimes it's kind of disorienting. Did I try this door? It's, I think it's locked too, right? Let's try the front door. It's locked. There we go. Yeah, big smoke is also an option. Very true. Uh, I also learned in my research that Kalaka means skeleton, which kind of makes sense. To I remember the year they uh, which was the name of the villain in Guacamole. So we didn't get bonuses that year. Which I think had a God little knows. less respect for the heritage of uh, Spanish and Mexican people, but maybe that's just me. Tiny bit. Oh, look at that! Cool Fortnite reference. Cool Viva Pinata reference. God, wait! Make your own ideas, Tim Schafer. Oh, I remember this guy. Fucking clown bone. Look at this. Perfect game. Clown bone in the first ten minutes. Hey, what's going down, clown? Hey, back <laughs> off, suit. Practicing. What's going down, clown? Break it down for me. Oh, look at these guys going nuts. Oh, they're birds. I thought those were just dudes far away for a second. Break it down for me. Uh, practicing what? It's, it's pretty obvious. Practicing I think he says what? he can only make Bring a snake. Neck, what does oh. it look like? Twist me up one of them, huh, fella? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Twist this, all right? Wow. What a piece of shit. Bet you can't do a cat. Shows what you know, buddy. I can do anything. I can do birds, amphibians, famous poets. Go ahead. Name one. Robert Frost. Robert Frost. Trying this is what I went with in my me, first eh? playthrough, too. <laughs> Trying to stump me, eh? Wow. It's Robert Frost. Oh, he actually gave it to me, right. Wow, all right. Now I have a Robert Frost-themed so thing. Finest work, don't you think, Sparky? Who's Sparky? Oh, I just, like, rubbed it on myself. Am I gonna have- is there, like, a static puzzle? Also, he just fucking pierced his heart with that. Death by Robert Frost-shaped balloon. This doesn't look anything like Robert Frost. All right, well, <laughs> what a schlub. Fake it till you make it, just like the bone clown. What Those is happening? Are completely blocking the sidewalk. He just left. Fire. I tried to examine a barrel, and he said, and he walked off screen and said, "What's up with these fucking crates?" Oh, there's crates behind it though. Um, why did you leave, man? <laughs> why did you go? Look how tiny these little birds are. I feel like that's something that might actually look better in the old version, you know, where they don't stick out as much. Because again, like, this is in, like, 30 FPS, I'd bet, and these are in, like, 60. It's kind of weird. What? I tried to go in that alley? Okay. Petrified forest. I remember here, I was like, oh man, I'm gonna get hit by a car. Doesn't this game just look awesome, though? All of these things are 3D modeled. I have, like, a whole folder on my computer filled with this sort of shit. Where it's, like, mist and, like, uh, early Nintendo game concept art. This is my car. Oh, I sold so many car travel packages when I was first starting out. When did I lose my edge? Huh. Someone said run down the highway. I actually think there's like an invisible wall. Something like that. I'm not walking on the freeway. I yeah, shouldn't okay. even be standing here. I'm not walking. I'm not even standing. Alright, can I actually go into this alleyway, please? Get. Go on, get. There we go. Oh, look at this. This is like some, like, fucking Clue Finders shit. I know it's... I mean, I know it's... They both took inspiration from the same thing. Also, damn. This icon is almost exactly like the, uh, the, like, PSI upgrade icon in Psychonauts. I just realized. I don't like the way that eye is looking at me. Uh, do I have anything to stick in it? Let's see, I got card... Deck of cards, another card. Actually, what is this previous card? It's like a it's business card. Special work order. Oh, for the poisoning, right? I got the Robert Frost balloon. Uh, my scythe. I like to keep it next to where my heart used to be. <laughs> Fuck it. Oh, that animation was amazing. I don't want to mess up my blade. I don't want to mess up my babes, blades, and blood. Blood bathes in babes. I'm 
Okay. Is this a is this a kerchief rope? I don't want to mess up my blade. Okay, put away your fucking blade. I like that the music actually stopped and now they're applauding for it. And now another song's starting up. That's pretty cool. Same composer. It's uh it's like Pete something. Same composer as Psychonauts. It looks like a rope, but it's really just a bunch of cheap ties tied together. Do it. Yeah, look at that booty. Oh, that is an amazing animation. Yeah, you can hear- I mean, this music right here is pure. Pure that guy. Alright, well, damn, Manny's very brave. <laughs> Instantly just does this. Without fucking thinking about it. I'm not skipping a beat. Oh, look at that. It's the blimp and the train and the boat. It's like the whole district is all about getting people to the world of the dead. Oh, it's like it's like the boss's uh -huh. office, right? There's or Domino's. Nobody in Domino's office. Fucking break a window. Use my sight. Oh yeah, this composer's all about that clarinet. I don't think I can actually just smash it with this. This is dumb, but I don't want to mess yeah. up my blade. I don't want to mess up my blade. I remember I need to get something to like get me across that gap over I don't there. Mess up my blade. Yeah, fuck it. That's not gonna work. <sighs> I think you can skip those animations too. Looks like the boss has gone fishing. Hmm. Same thing. Looks like the yep. boss has gone fishing. Okay. Wow. <laughs> I remember there's like something over here. Oh, I just need to, oh, what am I doing? I just need to go in. There's a fucking For some reason I was like, "Oh, this is my office." I don't want to go in there. I literally like saw the window open and just didn't even. It looks like Don's I'm, I'm fine. computer to automatically just being answer thorough. his intercom. That was one of those moments where, like, I realized my error the second that I, like, glanced, glanced over at chat and saw people going, Duh! It looks like Don's rigged his computer to automatically answer his intercom. Okay. Can I... Oh. Operate. There we go. Not now, Eva. I, for, for a second, I was like, not now, ever? Like, not now, not ever? I'll have to wait, I'm in the middle of a very important meeting. Didn't I say no interruptions today? Whatever it is, it'll have to wait. Ah, cripes, Eva! Jesus. I'm on the phone. These are all just... Oh, Jesus. I gotta do that one. I'll just change his auto-response here. If you buzz me again, I swear I'll jump out this window! Alright. His window's open. Am I like framing this man this for suicide? Mess. I'm gonna fucking murder him. Ba ba. Memo from the desk of Don Copal. I don't know what Copal hey, means. Anyone care to inform me? Office, and are not exchangeable among salesmen. Swapping, selling, and especially stealing work orders will result in severe disciplinary action. <clears throat> Well, no, I don't want to go there. Hmm. It's like with the little prompt here, there's just one that has like a little skull dude with like X'd out eyes. It's just the kill command. This place is a mess. Okay. I would love to search Don's office right now, but I'm mm. late for the poisoning. Okay. Oh, and I can't go out his like front door here. Hey. Okay. Anything around here? Okay. I guess is that all I'm doing? I yeah, there's no actual time urgency. Right now, but I'm late for the poisoning. Okay, cool. Well, <laughs> I'm out. Jump out the window myself. Oh wait. I would love to search. No. Dogs. No time to ransack. Eat Everybody's shit. at the poisoning but me. <laughs> Take that like clip out of context. I'm just getting out of the getting out the window. Oh what? Oh, I like took some length of it. Okay, that's how you do it. 
That was an accident, but here we go. Yeet. Look at that animation! Oh, that was great! Also, oh, I think I need a hook at the end. It's like my scythe or something. Right? It's, uh... This? <laughs> this wouldn't work, right? Combine. Combine. Nope, okay. <laughs> Didn't think so. Just wanted to see what would happen, honestly. My scythe. I like to keep it next to where my heart used to be. I think this is it. I don't want to mess up my plate. Nope. <sighs> Must be something else. I don't mind, uh... I don't mind the sort of, like, backseating. Just no spoilies, I guess, but, uh... Specific puzzles, I don't really care. Use the card. I doubt this. I doubt this very much. Those are some oh, ugly ties. I can't believe I climbed up that thing. Yeah, now you're gonna climb down it, bitch. Yeah, I assume I'll just need to poke around. This thing is like this is not secure. And, like these, the camera angles. I know you can also switch to tank controls, but guess what? Those also suck ass. Okay, so I'm gonna go talk to Eva and tell her to go make Domino kill himself. See, like, there's like some weird continuity of space stuff here, I feel like, with the camera angles. It's like they break the 180 line or some garbage like that. I don't want to mess up my... What is this all about? Oh. Oh, right! This guy! I remember this. It's not the guy driving that car, the big fucking orange dude. Whose name I forget. Uh, yeah. Whoa. These cars are on meat hooks. I feel like that's not a thing that people do in real life. Hang cars like that? Potentially. What's his fucking name? Men? <laughs> Hey, service! Hey, who the- <laughs> That ass! Oh, what? sorry, sir. I didn't expect the sales agents usually- This guy looks like a fucking Foster's Home for Imaginary Friends character. Nice hut! Hey, you a driver? This Me? Straight up goon. No, no, no. no. This guy is the definition of a goon. I'm Calavera. Manny Calavera. My name's Gladys. Gladys! Visitors. <laughs> hey! I got a message for a Mr. Calavera. Uh, your driver said that Mr. Hurley said that he could have the rest of the day off. Domino sent my driver home? Yeah, wasn't that nice? Gladys. Gladys? Yeah, like gluttony. Is that a German name? Oh, no. My roots lie <laughs> not in any earthly nation soil. I like his little ears I wiggling. An elemental spirit summoned up from the land of the dead itself and given one purpose, one skill, <laughs> one He's desire. He's thrusting. To drive! <laughs> or to change oil and adjust timing belts if no driving jobs are open. That like synced up with the music too. Nice hut. Yeah, I wonder how nice it would seem to you if you were trapped in it. Claudius is part like of the me. mouth. All right, I missed that. Looks Whoops. like I need a new driver. Oh, kind of does look like the Mario sixty four eel. Uh, I would agree with that. Yes. Kind of uncannily, you actually. You want to be my replacement driver? Me? Oh, oh no! Sorry, can't. What happened please? to the sidebars? Was that like cutscene? Come on, Gladys. I need you. I know to I need to get friend. something to like convince no, him. I can't. I'm, it's like someone to like cover I'm, his shift. I'm too big. Uh, <laughs> I like all these different options. It's like uh, there's a very unique way to write jokes in adventure games, and they sort of explore it here. You're not too big. The cars are just too small. Yeah, those dang compact cars. Hey. That gives me an idea. I could alter your car just a bit with just a quick twist.
court's job to let out the seams, you know? Uh, but I'm not allowed to modify the cars without a work order from upstairs. Oh, I could lose shit. my job. A work order? Job? <laughs> I can't torch anything bigger than a cigarette <laughs> without one of these signed by the boss himself. This is great dialogue in this game. That's my line. Getting people to sign back in a snap. Hmm. Yeah, too small. I'm not too big. Everything around here is just too small. <laughs> oh, that ass! I wonder if that's literally just the same animation rewound. I bet it is. That won't help it get signed. I hate doing that. It's a tool cabinet. Okay, yeah, whatever. Thank you, Manny. Fucking enthralling commentary. Wonder what this is. Is it a drinking fountain? Who's afraid of a little rusty water? Oh. Can you drink from it? Oh hell yeah, you actually can. Hey, huh? baby! Did you get that work order signed yet? No. Can we just do it without? I told you I could lose my job! <laughs> Manny! If I lose my job! Hey, 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 don't worry. Just go on back to work. There's a very surreal I'll atmosphere to lots of adventure games. Somehow. Where it's like you meet people and instantly they're just like, yeah, do this weird thing for me and I'll just be your friend for life. Fuck yeah, bro. I mean, if I can like ferry you across the like land of the dead. Land of the living. Can't go through on foot. People uh. have tried, but they never came back. Damn. A little bit of world building there. Hold on. Yeah, I guess if you just sit around there for long enough, he yells at you to get going. Kind of fun. <clears throat> Alright. Ah, uh, yes. Where was I? Getting Domino to kill himself. In Minecraft. That was something I learned recently. I went on a camping trip with some friends. One of them was Lark. And he, he and his other friend Sid have this, like, running gag. I don't know if it's, like, a meme from somewhere else or if they made it up. But whenever they say, like, something awful, they always follow it up with, like, in Minecraft. So, like, I hope, for example, just purely as an example, I hope the President of the United States dies and his last words are drowned out by the sound of him shitting himself in Minecraft. Just as a random example. You know, Copal's not really in his office. Sweetheart, I know what you're up to. Huh? You're trying to get me away from my desk so you can link all my paper clips together again. Grow up, darling. All right. Hmm. Actually, I don't think I'm gonna be able to do anything with the. Uh, if I really need the boss to sign this with the like order. the auto I'll give thing. It a shot. <laughs> Mr. Copel, I've got Manny Calavera out here to see you. If you bust oh, here me we again, go. Oh, Copel. I swear I'll jump out this window. Right. Eh, sorry, Cal. Maybe tomorrow. That's too late. Oh yeah, like you're going anywhere. <laughs> Damn. I can't find my driver. Manny, do I have to explain your job to you again? <laughs> I hope the Minecraft house you poured yourself into and worked on for three weeks is destroyed in Minecraft. Okay, that doesn't really work. <laughs> no, but I like to hear your description of it. Just for kicks. Well, how was the trip? It was fine. Than I know, picks up people <laughs> in the land of the living. Dead people. Preferably. Lark and I actually filmed and something for an upcoming video, and I fell over and ate shit. They qualify for. If he sells them enough premium packages, our hero will be free to leave the land of the dead. Until then, he and I are stuck here, having the same conversation over and over again for eternity. I, I got, I, I did what's known as eating shit on a Tuesday. I fucking fell over on my face and like hit a rock with my nose and I got like a big scab on it now, but I didn't like break anything. I didn't get like a bonk or anything like that, but uh, it wasn't fun. But I got, I got like, <laughs> I got various bruises and bug bites. Uh, there was a part where there were like a trillion fucking bugs. It was like love bugs or mayflies or something. These tiny blue bugs flying around in the air. And it was, it was horrendous. We got like a picnic, like raided by them. It was crazy. There were like seriously like millions. Whatever. 
Enough about me. What's your job? Like, blah, 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 blah. What if we just skip town tonight? You and me, baby. Well, thanks, the pre recorded awesome, message can tell her to sign it. it. All right, see, that's life. what I wanted. But in one piece, I mean. I bet I could get you out if I really tried. Oh, man. Blab about Look your scab. You. You're a trap soul and you don't even know. <laughs> oh, and I had like the worst night's sleep ever. It was awful. Like the first night, I just got like no fucking sleep. I was like cold and I hurt. It had been like seven years or some shit. It's like, not maybe not seven years, but like since I left Boy Scouts, uh, so maybe like five years since I had last camped. And when I was younger, I didn't even need like a sleeping pad. Like you could fucking like put down like a bunch of broken glass, and I lay down like a single white sheet on top of it, and I'm I'm asleep in like two minutes. But now that I'm old, I was like, I'm in pain. I need an air mattress. So. You know, it's cold. I don't fit in my sleeping bag. I actually had to borrow someone else's sleeping bag. I ordered one and it got delayed its delivery by a day. It literally got delivered to my front porch as we were like driving there. It sucked. If it had showed up on time, I would have just had the right kind of sleeping bag. But my tiny friend lent me his. He literally had an extra for some reason. I literally don't even know why he had. He had brought like a cot with him. Um, whatever. Why do some clients qualify for better travel packages? They led good lives. Good tries. How do you mm. define a good life? Better than yours and mine. So what did you do in life to get stuck here? What I did back in the fat days is none of your business. You know the rules. Did you sleep in pajamas or regular clothes? Just regular clothes. I slept in my normal ass clothes. Oh, I also listened to Mouth Dreams. Very cool. Yahoo! Great album. I keep thinking about the Amore one. That's Amore. That, that made me crack the What's fuck up. Like? like babysitting, except I don't get to watch TV. Bells. <laughs> we were quoting that all weekend. It was one of those things where we like listened to it on the way over, and then we were just saying that the entire fucking time. Yeah. I will say, I think Neil C is like starting to wear off on me. Oh yeah, and somebody commented a while ago that I say Cicerega wrong. It's like Cicerega or something like that. I think it's Cicerega. So my apologies. I'm probably going to accidentally call him Cicerega a ton of times though. So sorry. Yahoo. Yeah, but the thing that made me think of it was one of the lyrics is sleeping with my clothes on. If I really need the boss. Oh, right. Shit. Shit. I'm gonna go do the thing. I'm gonna go do the thing. Sorry. <laughs> There's nothing quite as uh, spasmic as flipping through dialogue options or flipping through dialogue quickly in a game like this. I have no idea what song that was in the campfire video. Sorry. Yeah, there's a video of the, of the camping group on Twitter. In Minecraft. My hand is worse now, thanks. <laughs> I thought it would be better from me not looking at the computer, but it is now worse. Shit. I need to- I just realized, uh... Let's... Give me the- Oh, shit, no. No. No, that's not what I wanted. Give me the- where was the fucking, like, sidebars? Am I crazy? Special features? Oh, fuck right off. I want the cool border. There we go. This game is from 1998. What caused your angry phone tweet from earlier? Have you ever heard the phrase, the straw that broke the camel's back? My back was broken six trillion straws ago by the amount of small errors that I experienced with my phone that is like maybe like four years old or something like that the amount of fucking like basic shit that just doesn't work at all on a phone that's even slightly out of date is so annoying and it was just they kept building up uh, and, and I was like you know what this deserves an angry tweet that'll show him oh fuck off no Dodd. I didn't even notice there was one that just said, just sign it for me. It 
looks like Don's kind of phone do I have? I need to like take off the case income. and look at the back. It's like a there's like a trillion Galaxy phones. It is a Galaxy S7. And they come out with a new one every fucking like picosecond. And intentionally destroy the software of all the old ones. Uh, all right. This is the one for when he's jerking it. Oh, here we go. All right, Saber, just sign it yourself, will you? I'm, I'm oh, all shit, the no. mark, right, Saber, just sign it yourself, will you? I'm Exit. Busy. Okay, I need to wait. All right. Yeah, thankfully I don't have an iPhone. That would be even worse from what I've heard. Uh, I've heard decent things about Google Pixel. Good God, I could never forgive them for those ads, though. Seriously, that's like... That's enough for me. I want it, want it! I want it, want it! Me want product, me want product! Twin Towers. Do you remember that commercial where they got a song that was like, consumerism the song? And they played it about 10 trillion times? Awful. Estoy pooping, I'm busy. <laughs> I need to play Peggle again, someone just said. Someone actually just said that. With the sort of tone that implies that they're being, like, real about it. Do you know? It's a whole bunch. Does he know Money how much Peggle I've played? Oh, this. Gets out the aggressions. Thanks. Gets the aggressions out, doesn't it? That's very memorable because I think it's completely pointless. Oh, that, those aren't pills. They're whole punchies. Can I fucking speak to her? Thank you. Peggle in Minecraft. Okay. Uh, well, I will. I, I literally will. I have Peggle 2. I'm going to stream Peggle 2. And I'm going to do uh, Peggle Knights pack at some point. Nobody has sent me any more Peggle Knights levels. I don't know if people are working on them or not. Uh, someone else said they were making another hack. I don't know. I don't know if I want to encourage people to make more entire hacks. If it's the sort of thing where like the level editor is kind of schmoky and you can't make like proper slides and stuff, which we've known for a while. That's why I was always kind of hesitant to do a Peggle hack. But when that when that guy made like a full one, I was like, all right, I'm gonna play this. Clearly a lot of effort went into this. Oh good, I'm getting a spam call, everyone. Uh, if I have here we go. Sorry, I'll get on with it. Mr. Cope, oh, pre-rendered cutscene. Something out here that he says he needs your signature on. Ah, oh, right, Ava, just sign it yourself, will you? Estoy pooping, Ava. Estoy pooping. You'll have to excuse him, Manny. It's probably a really hard crosswood puzzle he's got in there today. <laughs> Actually, funny. Ava, I mean. Actually, funny video games are fucking few and far between, in my opinion. Well, we all have us. So many have tried. <laughs> Only a man can light a cigarette proper. Oh, look at this. Nice. I can skip the whole rigmarole of actually going down there. Too hey, thick. I look good in this, don't I? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, they say black is slimming. I'm driving, yeah! I'm driving! <laughs> <laughs> you literally just like cut a hole in the top. Wow, is this taxi driver? Is that what we're doing? I like the bones on that railroad crossing sign. Faster than this. Ugh, híjole, I'm gonna miss the poisoning. <laughs> He's not listening. He's going Brrr. Oh my fucking god. Oh right! Oh right, this is what alive people look like! Holy fuck! I completely forgot about this! I completely forgot about this, but that's what the living look like! Oh my fucking god! Still give me the creeps. I this was entirely gone from my memory. Jesus Christ! Yes! Ah! It's the fear of death that makes monsters of us all. <laughs> oh my god! It's that, like 
change. Oh, okay. Okay. Scaring the living is technically against the rules, but we all do it. Eat the fries. I can't reap hamburger, cows, Burger. or a whole other bureau, not to mention the lettuce. Wow. <laughs> cows are a whole other bureau. Daisuki suki hamburger. I like hamburger. Professional. I like hamburger. Can I like move around? I love the like static music playing. This is fucking amazing. Can I? No. Okay. If I right. scare them to death, I'm then done. they'll become accustomed. Reap this man. Oh, the fucking like bell tolled when I did that. All right. There's no dedicated reap command. Nice bathroom. I, I don't know how I forgot about that because that's so fucking weird. Maybe it's just because it shows it for literally one screen and never again. But we offer several travel packages. Oh, it's like scared me. This little guy. You know, Manny, I could make this car a little faster if you wanted. Yeah, yeah. Whatever. Oh yeah, slam the front into the weeds, tub the rear end, two blowers pop it out of the hood. You'll get plenty that guy's of the fucking best. Martinez, and you'll be safe oh right! By the foam <laughs> he fucking like packs them in like a package. <laughs> oh, on second thought, uh, I want to upgrade my package. <laughs> Sorry Bruno, but you didn't qualify for anything better. But here, have this complimentary <laughs> No, wait. Uh, can't you find me This is the first day of the life? end of your life. You know I'd like to, Bruno. Somewhere I can move my, my legs. There's like jokes in every ass. second. I got is hard ass a bone joke? I got lazy sickle waivers like this jolly boy working for me. Manny, you couldn't find a sale at a yacht club. Wow. I got a sale right here. I'm talking premium sales, Calavera. Like the kind Domino makes. This is oh, Monsters Inc. It's Monsters Inc. It's literally this is Monsters Inc. It's Monsters Inc. Hey, Domino is Randall. Manny is Sully. Oh my god. You, oh my god, and Mike Wazowski is the big thick guy, and this guy's Mr. Waternoose. That's the guy That's the guy from Archie. No job. No, that's the guy from Monsters Inc. Never mind. Who's the fucking guy from Archie? Mr. Werberton? Mr. Werberton? Patrick Warburton? Scumbag. Why I on a... <laughs> Who the fuck is the like the principal in Archie comics? I'm sick of waiting around for a good lead. Like it's gonna fly in here tied to a brick. It's time to take one. <laughs> I'm gonna Google it because chat is not helping. Who's the fucking principal? Um, Mr. Waldo Weatherby, <laughs> popularly referred to as <laughs> the Bee. Thanks. Yeah, chat had my back the instant I moused off the window. Um. Uh, so what am I doing now? Guess I'm just uh. I don't even fucking know what I'm doing. Talk to her. Whatever. Hey, you missed a great poisoning. Yeah, and you missed a great client. Domino came back from there with a nun. Híjole, I got <laughs> a tiny little man with a mean temper and no commission. <laughs> well, at least you don't work for one. Little baby man. Just one more question about my job. Also, that was a Manny, good diss. Manny, you know what to do. Stop playing dumb just to flirt with me. Where is everybody? Oh, Manny, did- Oh, man, did I come in on Saturday again? It's the Day of the Dead. Everybody's back in the land of the living, visiting their families like we should be. Hmm. Why aren't you visiting your family today? Ah, the boss is here, so I gotta be here. How about you, Cal? No one back there I want to see. And you don't want Domino here alone getting all the good leads. That too. Manny, if you don't mind, I've got a lot of filing here to do. I need right. something to fucking, like, use as a grappling hook. That's like my only lead right now. Such an adventure game ass Big lead. Big Mr. Boss Man doesn't want to be disturbed Big today. Mr. Boss Man. I didn't know this was a Metal Gear. Ooh. Oh, look at this fucking Chad. He's got his mouth guard. I like that Manny walked in and instantly turned around. 
It's fucking Domino. Well, at least you're not hitting the bottle anymore. Hey, Kelly, how you doing? Hey, a bada bing, a bada boom. So, how'd you make out of the poisoning? Well, let's just say that Sister Calabaza has a secret passion. For trains. You got a nun? <laughs> Hail Mary. Uh. You sold her a ticket on the number nine train. Choo choo, little buddy. Wow. Took out his mouth guard just to say, say it. Say, how'd you score? Mmm, I got two nuns actually. I got two nuns actually. Hey, that <laughs> reminds me of this really funny joke. Heard it. <laughs> I want to punch you in the mouth. Oh no, not the Christmas oh, hey. party all More over Christmas again. party lore. Yeah, where is he sweating from? He has no pores. Wow, I didn't even think of that. Where is his bone sweat? I want to ask you a question. Shoot, slugger. Is it hard to kiss up to the boss so much when you got no lips? Pure hey, calcium. I, need. I get it from you. Can I have one of your clients? Sure, Cal. Just as soon as I get one I think you could handle. I wow. can handle anything you got, especially if that's your best it's right Punching there. bag crying. Why do you get all the good clients? You're asking the wrong guy. You should be taking a good long look at the man <laughs> in the No, the thanks. I don't oh! enjoy it the same way you do. Sorry. What did you do to get this job? You mean what's my secret to success? No, I mean. Do you know the you game The Room? Stuck here at the DOD. What's Talking about Silent Hill Four? Otherwise, no. Gonna have to work here to pay it off. Well, I could easily ask the same question of you, but I don't know the answer. I still don't know what I've done. Well, how convenient. Then uh, neither do I. Whoa. What happened at the Christmas party? He doesn't Blacked remember. Out on the whole thing, huh? Maybe you should switch to lemonade, kid. Uh. I want to tell you something. Good. Go on and let it all out, Manny. There's no reason for Whoa. you to be afraid of me. Transcription error. I think we should team up. Be partners. Oh, Manny, I, I would, but I'm too intimidated. Hmm. I could never be partners with someone who was so much more of a man than me. Oh, I like that his skull I've is like wife. lengthy. Like, what did what did Manny look like in real life? There was actually, when I was, I saw like a neat bit of fan art on like the Steam page, hold on. Oh, actually OBS has been being stupid about importing images, so I might not even be able to show you. That's fucking miserable. I can already see it happening. See, this is just another straw of shit just not damn ass working. We'll see if it works. Nice fapping sounds. Here we are. It's pretty good, actually. I saw that and I was like, damn, that's, you know what? That's not grotesque. I don't know if he's explicitly white. He is pretty pale. I don't fucking know. But it looks neat. You would think with like the stretched out face like that, he would just look like garbage. You know, this used to be my office. Yeah, I know. I found your name on some comic books in the desk. I want my office back. Don't worry, you'll have years and years mm. to enjoy it. Wow, After this guy's such a dick. Out, and you're still here. I think you're up to something. Yeah, I'm up to about four premium A lot of them, uh, many of the characters in this game do have a little <laughs> accent. Well, you sound pretty out of breath, so I'm gonna blow. Always a pleasure, Cal. And it's clearly taking inspiration from lots of Hispanic and, uh, like, Aztec shit. Look at his door, even. And then also fucking, like, Art Deco, a style that, as John Tron put it, they used for, like, two seconds and then never used again. And by they, I mean humans. Take his beer. Oh, shit. Wow. <laughs> Pick up and use are the same thing. Look at all the diplomas. You have to have the proper attitude to get the like Let's get like fucked, those, man. someone Maybe. says. I thought you just had to have the proper... That's some <laughs> premium looking scotch. Have some, Manny. Just so you don't forget what premium wow. tastes like. Every line he says something douchey. Desk drawers? 
I don't have desk drawers. <laughs> hey, get out of there, Calavera. Shit. Yeah, I'm probably not gonna be able to use Ain't any dumb. of this shit. What's your screensaver password? Get away from my computer, Manny. He's Imagine this, like your rival here, comes in here and just starts like poking around me. and you're just casually boxing. Did I already no, I already looked at that. Manny, just so you don't yeah, fuck off. Premium tastes like. I wanna punch Domino into next Domingo. <laughs> I don't even know. Does that does that mean week, month, day? I don't know. It could mean anything. Uh me out of here. So I'm looking for something I could theoretically use as like a grappling hook. Uh, chat, does anyone remember what exactly I need to get? Spanish for Sunday. Ah. Mm. Can't go down this hallway any further? No? Okay. That's bizarre. Alright. Domingo. Um, can I fiddle with a tube, perhaps? Hmm. No, there's nothing down here. Let's check it outside. Maybe, oh, the clown will probably... I think, doesn't the clown actually give you a bunch of different, uh... Oh, but, ah! What the uh, fuck?! You and your fancy suits and your nose... Fucking Next Dimension air, Patrick! Sticking your empty beer bottles down the message tubes. How fancy is that? Huh? Don't you boys upstairs realize the tube switcher is a sophisticated and delicate piece of machinery? Oh, I remember this. You think you're tube better switcher. than me? No. Good. Look at that ass! God, they just put a dumpy on so many of these characters, but that opens that door. All right. Yeah, this room. Look at this shit. This is so, like, quaint and cool to me. Oh, the fire extinguisher. It's the sophisticated and delicate hub of all communications here in the Department of Death. Right, I think I need to find, like, a combo for this, right? Nope, not that, nope. That's not on fire. Yeah, shut up. The wheel! Okay. Spin the wheel for the treasure to take. Careful, my friend, or he'll rattle and shake. Rattle me bones. Turning like slow, there's a frightening glow. But don't rattle me bones. Ba -da 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 -da. Rattle me, rattle me, rattle me bones. You can use your skill to take what you will. They actually put a fucking thing on the ground where the door opened. -da 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 -da. Batteries sold separately from Ideal. There's like scuff marks on the floor where the door opens. Now that's detail. Okay. Well. I'm gonna talk to the clown again. I seem to remember he gives you multiple balloon animals. And one of them you can actually use for something, right? My kid, uh, uh, dead worm. Okay, a cat. Tada! Tada! I'm just gonna get all of them. Put it away, Manny. My kid, uh. uh Another cat. But you can't do Robert Frost again. God, that animation is so crusty. That reminds me super heavily of uh, the wizard crackers in Harry Potter 1 on the uh, computer. Right down to the little noise that happens. My kid, though. Dead worm, too. Heck, that's easy. Wow. There's no limit on those. <laughs> it's just not even inflated. That's good. I think I've seen an actual clown do that joke before. Not, not met a lot of clowns. Can I walk through your tent? 
I want to see the parade. Well, walk through someone else's tent, all right? All right. Do I look like a turnstile to you? Kinda. Could you teach me how to do that? Well, um, since you're a beginner, why don't you practice the first step, which is blow. Uh. Bang. Uh, oh, the birds oh, flew away. Lousy, bony fingers. <laughs> Some festival, huh? Yeah. Yeah, pretty busy. My carpal tunnel oh my God. is really acting up. But you don't have any tendons. I have yeah. tendonitis, not have carpal tunnel tongue. syndrome, but still that funny. That doesn't seem to shut you up, now does it? Wow. My kid uh, wants another balloon. Uh, no, I already have all these. Bet you can't. Did you know? Well, then just enjoy it. <laughs> okay. Um. Oh, shit, do I really have to go through all of these options? Well, then oh, no, how embarrassing. Well. Oh, if I can get more of these, okay. Huh? Can I really just hold infinite dead worms? <laughs> it's got teeth! Oh my god, so could I just, like... I wonder if you, it's, like, this sort of thing where you can fucking, like, max out a, a value, like, a data value in the game. You know? Where you just fill your inventory with dead worms. Worm grinding. My kid, uh, wants a cheat. Do you have any more dead wells? Is this real? It's so tedious. Oh, shit. No, 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 no. My kid, uh, do you have any wells? God, I hate that you have to watch that whole animation. Okay, I'm done with this. I'm done with this. This whole stream is not just gonna be me getting worms. That I phrased that poorly. Okay, so maybe one of these. Get the bread. Get the worms. Oh shit! There's something on the ground there. That's that's kind of neat that they. I bet that's like a trap door that opens up when you do something here. Neat that they put a different footstep sound effect on that. The toolbox in the garage? Is that true? I'm gonna go there. Because I don't think these fucking balloons are gonna be a grappling hook alternative either. And was it this way? No. Fuck, which way was it? Down here? No. Shit, I don't remember which room it's in. I'm just gonna fucking trial and error. Because I think this is the, yeah. This is the sorting room, and then this other one's like the foam packing room, right? Hmm. It's eerie as fuck, there's just coffins in here. One of the chemicals for our packing material comes out of there. Go up and then down. Oh, right, 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 right. Oh, that's, mm. Right, yes, of course. How could I forget? Okay. Yeah, take your fucking time. He's gonna yell at me. He's gonna be like, "Hey, hey, Homer!" It's locked. Oh, eat ass. Not picking that up. It's a tool cabinet. It's locked. <gasps> okay. This was this was a this was a stinky trail that I've been led on. Goose chase, perhaps. Other toolbox. I'm gonna go with the next thing, which is filling the, uh, balloons up with, with cum. <laughs> Maybe this'll work.
Yeah, look at that tube animation. Right, and then... Oh, and it clogs up the tubes. Right? It like fucks with the tubes. I think I vaguely remember this. Now I need to go to my own, uh... Office. I really wonder if there's like a stack overflow situation. I mean, it would probably be like, seriously, like, millions of, of worms. What is that horrible squeaking noise you're making? New shoes. <laughs> Spang Bob. No, he's got a tight latex suit on underneath this. Put the lime and the coconut here. Yeah, cum balloon. Do I need to do multiple, really? Oh, right, because it's, uh, because it's like epoxy. Shit. Which one did I use? Fuck, I think it was the red one. So I'll do the blue one next. <laughs> Fuck, I, I remembered. I, I don't think we saw it here. Maybe I breezed past it looking at chat. I remember my first playthrough, he, like, made it clear that it was, like, epoxy. Where you have to, like, mix them together. So it was this one. Oh, right. Red tube. Blue pump. Alright. Eh, woo. Alright, I was just... I was not committed, I was not gonna... Trust me, guys. Thank you for the correction. But when I said I think it was blue, that wasn't like, all my money's on blue, I'm doing blue no matter what when I get in that room. You cannot fucking stop me from doing blue. I am unstoppable. She's like, man, what is he up to? What is he doing in here? Just running back and forth, squeaking? He's got some, like, weird fetish shit going on. Beepa. Alright. Let's see that stretch and jism. Oh, lord. Doesn't sound good. You know, I bet that's someone's fetish. Getting sealed in with, like, foam. I bet somebody's like, oh, yeah. That scene when the little guy... There's, like, one so person in the world who has what else is new? both a little guy fetish and a foaming sealant fetish. And they just loved that fucking scene, man. Mm. Uh... So now I need to, right. This fucking guy, man. This is so Monsters, Inc. Did Monsters, Inc. like rip this off? Cause it's got like the, the like automated system too. Hi, I'm not getting any messages. Is the server down? This is their idea of a joke? They think it's funny? <laughs> I'd like to jam their tubes with Whoa. my material. See how they like that? That's too far, so you're man. You're the server is down, is that it? The server is not down. It's never down. It's just temporarily unavailable while I'm doing some maintenance, that's all. <laughs> so how long is it <laughs> just immediately be refers to it as down like again. This, you can never tell. Probably ours. Or until no one's around to see you sneak out, eh? Whichever comes first. Mm -hmm. Can I squeeze in there just for a sec? Are you kidding? This is a highly secured area. It's highly no secured because your fucking ass fills the entire room, man. What's so special about you? I, sir, am an elemental spirit. Whoa. Summoned from the land of the dead itself. Is this a yeah, thing? Yeah, let me guess. Can I get some fact checkers? <laughs> one skill, one desire. Fixing pneumatic tube switchers. Blow no, his ass with the fire elevator, extinguisher. But they put in those I will no longer be taking requests today. Me out of work. No more requests. Who would do a terrible thing like this? It's those punks in the mail. Also, I have not they been using my left hand at all. I'm gonna switch back right damn now. Right. Switching back to left. 
That is. No, I really think it's clean enough. Oh, it's clean enough to run all right. I'm just fiddling around to be safe. You know, gotta cover my ass. Yes, you do. <laughs> just curious. Big butt. How'd you get in there? I squeezed down one of these tubes like a pixie. How do you think I got in here? Through the door, just like you. Say, uh, chatty cat. Right. I got a lot of tubes to flush here. <laughs> hey, me too. How about you? <laughs> me too. God, I love the dialogue in this game. This is great. Uh, oh, he's, oh, his ass crack. Come on. Huh? What happened? What happened? You tried to okay, I'm immediately going back to the right-handed right? mouse. It's really not hurting that much. Fire extinguisher. Spray that on this packing foam, and we'll both be oh. riding the giant Roman candle out of here. So now I gotta send the fire extinguisher Why down. Why they put something so dangerous in here? I guess they didn't expect this room to be full of hazardous waste. So which item am I going to use on this guy's ass? Fill another thing with packing sealant. Just shove it right up there. Just put a card down the crack. You know what? I think I actually do have to use the fire extinguisher. But I'm just kind of wondering. You know, show him the Robert Frost one. This doesn't look anything like Robert Frost. Nope. Wow, I just like rubbed it on his ass. Look at that. I just like tickled him. Uh, someone keeps, keeps saying use the rope. I don't have a rope, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> All I've got are these fucking balloons. I could tie them together and make a rope. Uh, so... That's not on fire. Shit. Uh, close the door. That's not on fire. Cheerful communications maintenance staff is well. on the job. Shite. I don't know what to do. Uh. God, look at him. The, the, like, I feel like the polygons were not even meant to be. Oh, I just had to leave the room. Fuck off. Good enough for government work. Fuck right off. That's the worst solution. Also, that animation had a frame of jank. Am I gonna have to do it again? Was that just like I just like fucked up the puzzle? Like, huh? Let's see here, did he like drop his keys or some shit? Jam the door. Oh, God, right. Okay, well, time to go get more balloons. Fuck me. I I'm glad I have a lot of dead worms. Okay, I this is nothing personal. But I'm just gonna use the good old ignore command on the person that's just been yelling, uh, random suggestions the entire time. Without actually knowing what to do. It's nothing personal. Um. Here we go. He tortures the worms again. No. Don't make me think that. Uh, apparently that person was saying rope because uh, they thought that the Robert Frost balloon was a rope, and then the instant they realized that, they just started screaming other suggestions. That's when you know the ignore command's gotta come out. It's gotta. Um. It's not torture, the worms like it. They say that about catcalling. I knew a guy in high school who would catcall girls. And I'd be like, literally like out loud, I would say whatever the like 2015 equivalent was of bruh. Like, don't. And he'd be like, no, they like it. And I was like, they literally don't. <laughs> they literally don't. 
He was such a creep. I, I learned later. He was a guy who, like, I was like, this dude's, like, a total weirdo and creep, and I don't like him. Why does everybody else seem to like him? And I learned later it was because he was a drug dealer at the school. <laughs> I'm just gonna skip it. I've already seen it. Uh, hey, can I see my inventory, please? What? <laughs> that was weird. Yeah, yeah, yeah. As much as I'd love to see that happen again. I like that he just sticks his face right in the camera every time he goes there and back. Server's down again. What else is new? Someone said it's starting to feel tedious. Yeah. Like I said, the gameplay. I don't know. It's like because I realized I didn't realize what to do here. Now I gotta do this whole rigmarole again. It's like, fuck me. Uh, so I don't think I have an item to do this. It's just, I need to like, lock the door. Alright. Um. Oh, you're kidding me. The deadbolt looks like it's not set. This tiny little thing. I clicked on the wheel. Open door. Strange, yet symbolically compelling. <laughs> All right, um, let's see, oh, I, now I just need to leave again. Because for some reason, leaving this room causes him to be done with, like, 100% consistency. Oh, shit. Good enough for government work. I bet I need to stick a playing card in there. The door is jank every time. Thick! Hey, thick! You know, I hate to see him go, but I love to watch him leave. Chat. <laughs> Classic move. Wait, how does that work? Wait! He just walked through Manny! How did that work? He, Manny walked out of the door after that guy was finished walking out of the door. But he's showing him walking out of the door! Oh. Oh, that's a good animation, yes! Did you see the layering there? Oh, only the finest layering here. That red tube looks familiar. Right. So now I gotta plug it up. And I gotta use the fire extinguisher. Oh, did I just go right past the card? I think I did. Wow, that was instant. Hmm. Oh, much air pressure. Shit. Like a stiff card. Take out the whole deck. Put the whole deck in there. Oh, he just took out another ace of spades. Just hold on to it. Just hold on to it, you fucking asshole. So I don't have anything else for this, right? I am yet again stuck. But I don't- I'll- just give me a second. Was it- cut a hole- oh, I have to hole punch the card! Oh, thank you, chat. I would've- that would've taken me ages. That would've taken me fucking ages. Right, cuz- oh, cuz the square- the rectangular card forms a fucking perfect seal with the round tube. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm forms a fucking perfect airtight seal. Uh-huh. This deck of cards is a little frayed around the edges. Then again, so am I. And I've got fewer suits. Uh-huh. You know, you might as well just say use hammer on button, chat. Manny, what are you doing? Just marking cards, honey. <laughs> Don't think about it. I did hole punch it a fuck ton of times. So now it's like basically a it's like a cheese grater now. Did I go right past it again? No. I love that every single card in this deck is an ace of spades. 
Yeah, buddy. Mercedes Colomar, client number 9308, blah, blah, blah. Died of chicken pox, time of death, yada, yada, yada. This music's kind of drowning him out. Attributes, volunteer time, reading stories to dying children. Mm. That's good. That's really good. I think mm. you read Mercedes Colomar. I think you Oh, yeah, I think that's me. the chick on the front of the game. Oh, and now we're doing this. Cool. Pilates, are you loco? What got into you? Yeah, oh, a little eight ball gear oh, shift. Yeah. And it's even better Fuck company. yeah. He's I'm got in. the crazy eyes. <laughs> you know what this kind of reminds me of is, uh, I mean, besides full throttle, uh, this particular shot. Oh, look at that. Domino. Nice! Fuck yeah, that's badass. Grim Reaper riding in the back with flames. Buenos dias. <laughs> You're not the nurse? I'm sorry, I trailed off. I forgot what I was talking You're about. You're not here to give me my medication? No, but I am here to ease your pain. It reminds me of Normality. That's what I was going to say. Me, huh? No. Which is an infinitely Thank shittier game, but that's a lot of maybe even more entertaining for its old jankiness. It's that good. Miss Colomar. Meche, please. It's a femme Meche. fatale. I can see it in your face and in your file here, where it says you're entitled to a first-class ticket to... Nowhere? What? Did I do something wrong? Not according to your bio. It was spotless. At least the part I read was. I'm not sure I like the implication, Mr. Calavera. <laughs> She's showing like bone cleavage. Huh. Are you sure you're Mercedes Colomar? Yes. Would you like to see my birthmark? <laughs> sure. Where is it? It's wherever you guys put my skin. <laughs> Anything about your past you haven't told me? Quite a bit, considering yeah, the lighting's you half decent. Did you kill much when you were alive? Very little. <laughs> never killed anybody? I have to confess, I never killed anybody. <laughs> not even a teensy. I would not be this coy I just wasn't trying hard if I was getting asked these questions right after I died, by the way. I would not be this like, oh, well, maybe I have, maybe I haven't. Ooh, you just don't know. Were you a big shoplifter? Well, they accused me of it once. Really? But it wasn't my fault. That puppy followed me out of the store. Mm. Oh. Mean to animals? Oh no, I love animals. Once, when I was volunteering at an animal shelter, I- Just stop right there. Mm. Ever cheated on your taxes? I've never paid taxes in my life. Aha. Uh -huh. I've never made enough money to be taxed. You know, it's mostly like, been all volunteer work. Mm -hmm. It's like, what if he just went and like, snapped his fingers and it's like, oh yeah, you're in hell forever now. Ever cheated on your husband? Mr. Calavera, there's no ring on my finger. <laughs> She's like patting her skin on it either. bouffant that doesn't exist. Me, then. Litter? Oh, Manny, is that the best you can do? Work with me, Meche. Give me some dirt. Well, I could do something bad right now if that would help. Wouldn't count. Sorry, I give up. Don't say that, Manny. You know what I have to do? I just have to go straight. Sorry to be so much trouble, Mr. Bone Calavera. stripping. It's no trouble. But please, call me Manny. All right. Well, shit. Bones clacking. Um, give me the Robert Frost balloon. Am I gonna have to make the building fucking explode? Shit. That's, that's all the dialogue, but I haven't right? found yeah. anything for you yet. Maybe I'm not the woman you were hoping for. She looks fine to me. <clears throat> fine bones. I'm sorry I let you down, Manny. Oh God damn it. Oh, I thought there was going to be like another cutscene. I was going to be mad. Domino's door is locked. When the solution is leave and give up, that's a shit solution. Oh, hey, hey, hey kind of was. Look at how crusty he is because he's pre-rendered. Oh my god. That was amazing. To secret information it's like so compare like side, to, side by side him and Manny and in that right same shot. And run Domino here off the road. All in order to steal a client from her legitimate agent. Uh. There's nothing legitimate about this place. You give all the good clients to Domino. 
Manny, now Look I'm at his office. Everything looks so great in the background and stuff. The whole office. I'm going to call the woman in here so you can apologize to her. How is he yourself? fat? <laughs> Ava, send in Ms. Colomar, please. She left about 15 minutes ago, sir. He's wearing like one of those Halloween fat suits. Walking? She had a ticket on the number. Walking? We got to use that, man. <laughs> That's a good walk. Now you see why I give all the good clients the domino. That woman was a saint and a shoe in for a double end ticket that she's not going to get because you just couldn't find it. And now, because of your little stunt, she's out there. On her own. Right, and we gotta go rescue her. Petrified forest, facing the uh oh, sad the Manny face. Unprotected. This is her reward after a lifetime of hardship and public service? Her destiny stolen by some overreaching salesman. He's like Jay Jonah Bonison. Get in there and stay put until the boys downtown. Oh, tell damn. They want done with you. Someone's I'm in the men's room. For this Calavera, and it ain't gonna be me. Hi, Glottis. Is your name Men? <laughs> That's the word on your door. Oh, hot babe. I don't see anyone out there. No, I don't want to damage my blade. No? Anything to do in here? It looks like it dispenses something called Ooh. Philodent. Philodent, right! Ready for the stock chomp sound effect? I think they need to use a balloon, right? Ooh, ick. It came out like soft serve ice cream, but judging by the smell, I think it's auto body filler. Mm. Wasn't there like a. There's like something where you have to like bite down. You gotta get his mouth guard, right? Something like that. Do I have a dead worm? I don't think I do. Nope. Fuck. Can I just leave? Oh. Hey, Glottis! Hey, anybody out there? Oh. So, man, <clears throat> have you thought about what you have done? <laughs> Who's out there? I'm you. Or rather, I was you. Years ago. Oh. Yeah, well, I'm me now, so get lost. <laughs> get me out of here. The only way out, Manuel, is to be taken back in. It's Che Guevara. Kind of is, company. right? I forgot Declare this guy. Loudly. The management might hear and stick you right back. Oh, God, I forgot throat. about this whole subplot of, like, the revolution. Yeah? Well, I got something they can stick in their fold. Whoa. You have to try harder than that, Lots of Manuel. butt jokes and, and putting things dead. inside you jokes. My loyalty still to the DOD, believe it or not. Mm. Should have got more worms. Good boy. You just keep up that spirit, and I'm sure you'll get out of here soon enough. Okay. Uh, can we do that again? A guard! Uh, it's not a guard. How's my little count of Monte Cristo. <laughs> walkies! Cramped, ready for walkies. Uh, if you are still loyal, lay down and roll. All these over sound and files. The fight song, I know. Look, I did what I had to do. So what? You have to try harder than that, Manuel. A man's loyalties decide his destiny. Mm -hmm. The DOD runs a crooked game, and I intend to prove it. You would do that? That could cause this agency a lot of trouble. Mm. I'm gonna blow the lid off this place. Young Flip man, your lid. You are an enemy of the Department of Death. Nice. Welcome to the club. Uh. Salvador Limones and guest. All right, here we go. Here's the door. To the headquarters of the LSA. See, that looks so nice for the era. The Lost Souls Alliance. The, the animation in this game is very fucking bumpy, though. Like, it's all over the place. Sometimes it's good. Sometimes it's awful. Intelligence unit. You know Eva, of course. Manny. I was once a reaper like yourself, Manuel. But I uncovered a web of corruption in our beloved Department of Death. Hmm. I have reason to believe that the Bureau of Acquisitions is cheating the very souls it was chartered to serve. I think someone is robbing these poor, naive souls of their rightful destinies, leaving them no option but to march on a treacherous trail of tears. Walking on the trail of tears, like Cherokee! Like What's your evidence? That's where you come in, Manuel. 
Or should I call Anybody remember that? Agent Calavera. Fucking Maddie Europe. Spoon. Other Europe songs besides the final countdown. Shara Key, walking on the trail of tears. So I can work off my time and get out of this dump. Well, you won't even be able to get out of this city without my help. Which means, of course, you won't be able to find that woman and you'll never get your job back. When you're ready to join the cause, my friend, come talk to me. We might be of some use to each other. Tenured evil. Oh, look, she's in on it, too. I didn't even realize that was the secretary lady until she started moving and checking her nails. So you're not really a secretary. I'm a spy, Manny. Well, that's the last time we use that temp agency. <laughs> Ava? You gotta get me out of town. They're gonna sprout me. You can't leave, Manny. We need access to the DOD computer network if we're ever gonna find out what's going on. And we can't access without a salesman like you. Mm. The computer IDs you when you log on. How mm. does it do that? Fingerprints? I don't have any. Your teeth, <laughs> Manny. Haven't you ever noticed your oh, computer that's the computer scanning your teeth dental. when you log on? I thought that was just a power search. We need your teeth, Manny. We can't let you go. <laughs> We need your teeth. So I need to get the mouth guard from the other guy, and I need to fill it with dentals. Any messages for me? Yes. Join or die. But uh, I'm already... Again! No step on snake. I wonder where you are. Don and Don I will finish the whole game. Not today, though. Office ...with some bigwig from downtown. Some fatty in a fez. <laughs> hmm. Who is the fat man, I wonder? And how does he fit into this sinister puzzle? There's so much, uh, like sort of DNA of psychonauts in this too like the the like paramilitary vibe especially the blue blueprints of like a tank it looks like that's like straight out of psychonauts how long have you been a spy Salvador recruited me about a year ago I couldn't resist him he's just so noble what are you working on there? I'm trying to get this radio working so we can use it in the field. But it looks pretty hopeless. Salvador's right. We need good old-fashioned homing pigeons to communicate mm. with our field agents. You have field agents? No, it's just Sal and me right now. But someday, Manny. So, you won't help me out of here? Sorry. I'll help you out, but not your teeth. Think it over. <laughs> we need your teeth, honey. We need your frickin' teeth, all right? All right. Okay, I'm in. What do I have to do? I'm going to build an underground army of souls to fight the injustice I have seen in El Marro. Communication will be El Marro. as a lost soul alliance spreads out. We'll need messengers we can trust. You want me to be your messenger? No, my friend. Our numbers are small and our agents are too valuable to risk that sort of work. History shows only one messenger to be of use to a cause like ours. Carry your pigeons. Uh, oh, right. Yeah, 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 yeah. If I grab some pigeons off the roof, will you Good let God. me go? No, I need to raise them from birth, Agent Calavera. I need you to bring me their eggs. Eggs and teeth. You're keeping me here because what the you need the eggs? Why are you still here, Calavera? Go get me an Calavera? egg first before it hatches. It's kind of fun to roll your R's or just do that. I don't even know what to call that. Like the difference between Calavera and Calavera, you know? I don't know. I, Do you know something? You I might think I'm a fuckface for doing that, but it's just kind of fun. Even your best clients never seem to qualify for the packages you know they deserve. Yeah. Trilling. My okay. My last client in particular, Mechi. Well, they all did qualify. I like to trill. Especially Forgive me. But somehow, somebody with access to the files has stolen their just rewards. Their sweet hereafters. Mm. Their tickets on the number nine. Scams. What would they do with the tickets? A ticket on the number nine is like a leaf of gold, Manuel. Especially to one who has died with a less than perfect record. Someone is profiting here from those that would buy their way into heaven. Why would you be a fuckface? Some would say that because I am a white boy, that that is not a cool thing to do. But money's not important here. I would probably not we agree with that, out. but I'm just saying there's people who would probably think that's not chill. And so do I someday. But for some people, this world is all there is. They have decided to seek pleasure and happiness here. Like similar the tier of like a American that, dude getting a Japanese get tattoo. Now that's all the briefing you need, soldier. Viva la revolución! I don't think that kind of cultural exclusivity is cool, but you know. Spanish is a, it's a cool sounding language. They, it always sounds so fucking fast. If you ever hear, like, native... Bro, enjoying accents is kind of cringe. Uh... It's, uh... It's very fast. It always feels like, oh my god, if I, I... 
I feel like if I knew Spanish, I'd still be like... I'd be like fucking out of breath just listening to this. Oh, he smokes when you sit there long enough. As a Mexican, I give you permission. Well, you heard it here first, folks. So now I need- oh, I need his dent- no, I need the thing. I need the thing from the guy. It's fine if you're Scottish! You're- Sorry. Yeah, I have heard some people just literally can't roll their R's. It's just like... Something about like your tongue or I'm some shit. Going in there. They still think I'm locked up. Hopefully. It's like I wonder if like <laughs> people- people who speak Spanish if they, like, learn English, they're like, man, people just speak so slow in English, you know? They still think I'm locked up, hopefully. Oh, right, I need to, okay. Need to go through the back door. Speaking language, speaking Spanish is rap the language. Oh, come on, what is this? Right, right, right. I just don't know why I couldn't, mm. So people can't whistle, too. Or find it very, very difficult. It took me a while to figure out how to snap my fingers when I was young. Which, by the way, a fandango or a flamenco dance can also include snapping your fingers instead of, uh, castanets. Actually, do I even need the guy's mouth guard? Or no, I need to climb in through his window, probably, right? Doi. <laughs> Estoy doy. Yeah, is it really the same speed? I don't know. Someone else, someone earlier said, yeah. Yeah, we talk fast as fuck, bro. But I don't know if that's actually true. It might just be from a lack of understanding on my part. Oh, he closed his window. That's sad. It's locked. Fuck. There's a special kind of snap for flamenco dancing. Isn't that like they use like their middle fingers too so they can do like really fast ones, right? Is that what you're talking about? I think I saw that. I, I like looked at a few videos of it. There was like a, there was some like Colombian version of it where they fucking put a candle on their head, like a lit candle and dance around and the wax just like drips down them. Looks hazardous as fuck. I can kind of, I, I can kind of snap with my uh, index and middle finger. I mean, it's muffled because of my wrist brace right now. <laughs> uh, I don't think I can break the window with the fire extinguisher. I, usually those sort of like uh, brute force type solutions are, yeah, are not really a thing. All right, well, I'm still looking around. That's not on fire. <laughs> fuck off. That was the middle finger. Ah, uh, yeah. It's kind of a weak snap. That's my index finger. That's okay. Middle finger, ring finger, pinky? <laughs> There's my pinky snap. Yeah, I, a louder sound would be breaking my pinky. Uh... I can go to the left on the balcony. Walk around the building. I don't know who to trust. Oh, well, yeah, left on the balcony doesn't lead me anywhere, I don't think. Does it? Wait. I thought I went there and all the windows were still closed. Fuck. Oh. Just wanna skip this cutscene. Nope. I could have sworn I just, like, checked around. Yeah, they're all closed, right? Is this- is one of these open? No use for it. No use for it. Hmm. Dom's office is empty. What? Okay. Could it not have been open? Wasn't it closed before and it was locked? I just need to like trial and error it. It's cool. Okay. Um, whatever. Take his mouth guard. What the? 
What the frickin' higgity heck? What was that? What happened? What just happened? It looks like a glowing. It was like a weird sound. Oh, that's the thing I used for the fucking grappling hook, right? Oh, I remember now. The fucking coral. Coral, mate. Coral, you're a fucking idiot, mate. No, I'm not gonna use the fucking thing on it. Is that his? Yeah, look at that. I was gonna say his mouth guard's sitting up there, and by sitting, I clearly mean floating. <laughs> that's so bad. It's like the sprites aren't properly al aligned with the background textures. Also, he's such a manlet. Manny the manlet. Has to punch the punching <laughs> bag to get him- get it out of there. Alright, I think that's all I need, right? Yeah. Let's just check this out. Oh, eat shit and die. I'm gonna try to guess his password. By the way, I just want to make it clear. The term manlet is super dumb. Nope. It's not golden, boy. I totally, as, I would like to say as a tall I person. Through the oh, right. Now. I'm on the lam. I advocate for short people. People give them shit for no fucking reason, and it's stupid. You, you literally can't choose how tall you are. It's like, huh? Also, he just stepped right through that window ledge. Like, I'm six foot three. Manlet is kind of a funny term. But it's also like, it's always used so cruelly. Oh, that's the sound the coral makes. Ah. So fucking weird. It, every time. I wonder if that's how Domino meant it to be used. It's just, he's just in timeout. He's just facing the wall. Something about that makes me chuckle. I, I'm very uncomfortable right now. I might need, to, might need to stop streaming and go take a walk or something, because my back hurts. I got fucked up while, like, trying to sleep in the in a tent, like I said. I'm in all sorts of pain. Oh god, did you see the whole color of the rope just change when it went to pre-rendered cutscene? Ooh, yo! Good alignment, yes. Very good. I think I'm pretty close to, like, the second chapter or something like that. You know, I should be... Oh. Save. Save. Oh yeah, my last save file was in fucking 2016, by the way. That was the last time I saved in my first playthrough. Alright, got some carrier pigeons. Oh right, don't I need, like, something to feed to them? Bread or some shit? Pigums. Cause I, I remember they get spooked when I go close, right? Hey! Hey! What the fuck was that? Hey! They might not know how much scarier a dingo is than a regular dog. Hmm. Do I need another fucking dead worm? Is that real? Um, oh, do I have a cat one? I do have a cat one. What the fuck is this? It's Domino's mouth. Oh, Why right. am I carrying this around? Here we go, here we go. Oh, I think it's that I need to spook them. No. I think they're actually laughing at me. Uh, I need to, like, get them away to get the eggs. It's like, Manny, you piece of shit. Can you just go in there and go shoo? shoo. Yeah, go shoo. Shoo. Fuck. All right, well... Time to go talk to Clown again. I don't remember there being any, like, food. But I'll check around. What kind of, like, piece of shit is Manny? He can't scare away birds. Freaking huh? Talk to Mr. Clown. Oh look, bread. Give me that. That's part of the background. Since I really didn't get to celebrate the festival this year, pan de muertos. I think I'm entitled to a little pan de muertos. I'm gonna get a mo another worm. Oh that shit! No, be a very good damn it! Of this special ceremonial bread. Me. My kid. Uh, look, if so, forget Oh it. damn! 
Oh, he stopped giving me some. Damn! Yeah, the voice acting in this game is great. It's not absolutely stellar for every character, but uh, Manny's voice actor, at least, is, is great. Fucking go over there. Go back, get bread. Oh, okay. <laughs> this animation. Woo! Woo! Go up there. Go! Go up there! What are you doing? What the fuck was that? Okay. Up to go up the whole thing! <laughs> yeah, the whole thing! Mm. Oh, they just automatically do it? Oh. Let's get this bread! <laughs> Crusty bread, crusty jugglers. Watch it. What the fucking? Excuse me? If I just hand it to him, I'm liable to lose a finger or two. Oh, fucking, do I have to toss it? There's no toss command. Just toss it over there. That wouldn't be a very good use of this special ceremony. Mm -hmm. it comes all over. Mm -hmm. He just stuffs all that shit in his jacket. Mm -hmm. People saying I need a bowl? Oh. In the map. Oh, fucking lord. Oh, fucking lord. I think that is it. It's like triggering a memory. Good god, I think that's actually it. Holy fuck. No wonder adventure games fucking died out, man. What the hell? What the actual hell? <laughs> ah, the animation! Oh, he's just grinding it with his bone hands. Awful. Miserable. That is a truly miserable puzzle. Get him off me! Back off, birds! I'm warning you, you little roof chickens. Show some respect. What? Wait. Did I not do it right? Wait, fucking huh? Huh? I prefer to eat out of clean dishes that aren't nailed to the roof. I need to put the cat balloon in the bowl. Also, listen to this music. Why? Wait, what? Huh? Maybe that will scare them. It literally Thank fucking you. huh? Oh, so it doesn't- it probably doesn't have to be the cat. It could just be any balloon animal. I thought the conceit was, oh, they'll get scared by the balloon animal that they just established they're not scared by. But I guess it could have been any balloon animal. And it's because of them popping it, because adventure game designers smoked 7,000 lines of cocaine every day of work. It's like, literally, what the fuck? Could he not just walk up to them and pop the balloon? Fucking huh? I'll just take a little more bread to honor the dead. I just fucking truly huh? I think that's part of the reason why this game is not quite as remembered as perhaps it should be. Psychonauts, for the most part, didn't have unintuitive adventure game bullshit, though. Bread. It did a little bit. It had, like, an inventory system and shit like that. Oh, god damn it. But, this is next level. Holding a giant scythe, there truly is no other way. Mm-hmm. Alright, I gotta watch uh, this shit. I can skip it. No, skip it. Skip it. Please, 
Please. This gonna work? All the way up. Why is you need to why do you need to click that twice? Yes, I'm very excited for Psychonauts 2. That's gonna be fucking awesome. I bet. I mean, I don't know. We're not guaranteed an awesome game, but... I think it is. This particular puzzle is on fucking crack cocaine, though. All the joy that I got from that bread animation has left my body. God, my... Yeah, this, my back really hurts. Jesus Christ. I guess we're sneaking up on two hours here, so that's probably a good place to call it quits soon. I think we're just about to get to, like, the second area of the game. I think it's split up into four parts, if I remember correctly. Hmm. Yeah, beat it, you lousy little ledge pickers! If Psychonauts is so good, why did 505 Games sell the license for Psychonauts 2? Because it's the game Psychonauts and not Psychonauts 2. Probably. Different games. Also, all that for a fucking egg. You must come with me, young ones, for I am the Green Reaper. <laughs> Take more I eggs. Think I get out of here with these eggs more eggs! Vultures come back. Now, if I drop the eggs, I have to redo all that puzzle. Do you think the new Crash Bandicoot game is good? I haven't played it. So, couldn't tell you. I have actually barely played any Crash Bandicoot in my life. I have the Insane Trilogy. I'll play it eventually. That's that's my catchphrase nowadays, is I'll play it eventually. So now I gotta put my, uh, my goo in the teeth holder. And then go downstairs, and I think we're gonna go to the second year. Or whatever. Hey, what did they and do Someone said I'd be going to the first year. Egg! Augustus Gloop. Philodent. Good for dents, great for dentures. Ready for the chomp sound effect? Oh, that's not even the stock one. For some reason, wow, I remember that, that being like the stock chomp sound. And like quite a chalky aftertaste too. All right, hell yeah. We got eggs, we got teeth. That is literally what we needed to bring to the revolutionaries was eggs and teeth. Fuck me. I think the goal is to get out this door, basically. Can I? Oh shit. No. Got something here that might oh, okay. interest you. Sweet. Whew. Okay. Oh yeah, by the way, I'm just curious, how many viewers we got? Just before I go off stream. I just want to see. I'm I, I'm generally curious with like uh 256, that's pretty damn good for Grim Fandango on at noon on a Monday. It's pretty good. All right, I'm not done yet though, not quite. Give my teeth to the bitch over here. Manny, this looks like a perfect impression of your teeth. Mm. We can use this as a mold to make a. <laughs> How does she know? And get into the I'd recognize this teeth way. impression Good anyway. Work, Okay, it's, I started the stream at, like, noon. It's two now. All right. And I got the eggs for this guy. I got your damn eggs right here, bitch. Throw them in his face. These babies are going to war. Mm. Check these babies out. Excellent, Manuel. With these, <laughs> I can breed an entire army of winged messengers. Our revolution can spread now across the land, carried on the shimmering wings of justice, thanks to you. Agent Egg Calavera, time. you are a friend of the revolution, Agent Calavera. And now, let me be of service to Only you. 140? Probably not super soon. You want to find your lost soul. I think you this is it. We're going to the second year. I don't, but everyone who wants to get to or whatever. Underworld Whichever one it is. I'm assuming the one that follows the first one is the second one, but I might be wrong. 
long as you get it's like the first year of the trip this is like the zero year it may be quite maybe i'll wait as long as it takes manuel grab some eggs and just like that you're a communist love love is for the living that's a that's a very famous quote reason i'm pretty sure is it actually i remember when i saw that i was like oh my god that's what that's from love is for the living but I don't even remember where I've heard it now that I think of it. Look at this shit. I'm all the way to the edge of the petrified forest. I love these 3D modeled trees. Huh. Awesome. I just like ah, pop through those. I think I just clipped hometown. through that. May I never see it again. Mm. Mm. No, never mind. Alright, folks. Well, that's that's it for today. Uh, I I've been enjoying this. I, you know, I think this is gonna be good with chat here to like, s sort of like, poke me in the right direction when I truly have no idea what to do. Uh, d d there have been a couple of puzzles that I figured out on my own. But, uh, yeah, it's, this is a very charming game. And I, I can't wait to play more of it. And if I finish this one, maybe I'll move on to... I'll probably do at least one other spook game this month. Uh, Off, or Yume Nikki, or uh, Day of the Tentacle Remastered, which I also have. Uh, we'll see. So that's another uh, another Tim Schafer vaguely spooky game. I don't know when the next stream will be. Uh, I might even do just a pure talky stream, either JoJo or reviews later today. What the fuck is that sound? Uh, but yeah. Uh, I've never played Day of the Tentacle. I've played Off before. I've never played Yume Nikki. Off is great. That would be like almost a one-parter stream, man. I could almost fucking speedrun that. Especially if I just looked up the solutions to those fucking puzzles with, like, the cards and the switches and shit. Uh, but yeah, th thanks for watching, guys. Enjoy the rest of your day. Bye-bye.